Lisa, congratulations. It was close, but in a city that voted 60% leave, Labour candidate Lisa Forbes managed to see off the challenge from the new Brexit party. On the day that Theresa May ceases to be leader of the Conservative Party, my message is to all the squabbling contenders for the Tory party leadership, bring it on. We are ready for a general election. In yeah! Yeah! At Peterborough Market this morning, locals were digesting the detail. In its first ever shot at a parliamentary seat, the Brexit Party's share of the vote rose from zero to 29%. Clearly at the expense of the Conservatives, whose vote share dropped by 25%. With a stronger showing from the Lib Dems, up 9%, Labour just squeaked to victory, even though its share of the vote fell by 17%. Jean voted leave and was one of the many who stayed loyal to Labour yesterday. I think they've got a broader, broader spectrum of dealing with the issues and I think they'll do it because I still think that they represent the ordinary people. While lifelong Tory voter Viv switched to the Brexit party. It was the only party I thought could get in and start to stop this silly system that we've got in the country with this two-party system. It doesn't work. What does the new Conservative leader need to do to get your vote back? Get us out of the European Union. In Westminster, Peterborough's message to the Conservatives has been heard loud and clear. Yes, absolutely, we have got to deliver on that referendum. We've got to make sure that people can see, however they vote in 2016, we're going to do what we said we would do. And if the Brexit Party leader was disappointed, he certainly wasn't showing it. We've come within a whisker of beating the Labour Party's national by-election team. Listen, it's a massive, massive step forward. I always said we'd give this our best shot. I said yesterday I thought we'd run this close. Boy, did we. Even so, failure to win a seat at Westminster does dampen the momentum the Brexit party had built up and this result gives all the political parties much to reflect on.